Well, it was a tough game for us, but we wanted to play. Um, we, we weren't too certain what to expect from all of us, myself included. I thought we handled it very, very well. We decided that we wanted to, to play a game. We decided that we didn't want anyone to feel sorry for us. Um, and I asked the kids just to put out your best. Whatever, whatever happens, we, we accept that. We, we just wanted to play. I've always said, and I, I think I want to win more than anyone else, but it has never been just about winning. Well, no, it's not even about football. Dominic left us. And that is tough. But we have some youngsters here that we just want to see them happy again. We just want to see them strong again. And we still think that we can do well in this competition. We don't want anyone to feel sorry for us. I've said this before. Pray for us. Um, these youngsters have worked hard and we thought with Dominic we were going to do well. We think without Dominic we are still going to do well. We miss him. We love him. I certainly wish he was here. His mother and father, they spent some time with us today. They sat on the bench with us today. They are two of the strongest people I've ever met. And I think because I am, I am this crier, I think a whole lot of people are so concerned about what's going on with me and what's going on with the team. And I've said it before, this is not about us. A mother and father lost their only child. And every time I, I cry, every time I get sad, every time I get depressed, it is because I think of how they might be feeling. It's not about us. I certainly appreciate all the sympathies. I certainly appreciate everyone who's sent all these messages to us to, for us to be strong. But I ask everyone to, to channel those prayers to the family of, of, of Dominic. I call him Alessandro, it's his middle name. He was named after Alessandro Del Piero, that outstanding midfielder from Italy. And I call him Alessandro. He was